Hey guys, Coach Jeff here with another Pro Hockey Breakdown. Today we're going to be looking at a uh, breakout with uh, passing in the offensive zone. I'm going to let it play through real quick so you guys can take a look at the play and then we'll break it down. Awesome, there you have it. Um, so taking that back to the beginning here, uh, we've got a, a standard breakout happening in the neutral zone. And uh, just to make sure everyone's on the same page, of course, we're going to make sure that you can see where the puck is. So we've got it right there. And so they're going to enter uh, over the blue line on sides. And then what you're going to see here is the magic of passing in the offensive zone. So first pass is going to happen right across. And what you'll see is we've got one defender here. And keep in mind what's happening with the goalie over here, but the defender is going to end up getting drawn where the pass is going, which uh, leaves the original passer right here uh, pretty wide open. So let's just see how that unfolds. Pass is made. Defenseman had a chance at getting it, but it just kind of slipped through. It was a great pass. You can now see the puck made its way over from here over to here. And there's a couple a couple opportunities here um, for additional add-ons to the play. One thing that could happen is once he gets it on his stick, he can shoot it on the net. Um, if he's feeling a lot of pressure from the D, uh, he could skate it around one way or another. Um, and or the last thing that they could do would be to make yet one more pass um, back to the side, which is what you'll see happen here in here in just a second. So it doesn't quite have enough opportunity to get it on the stick to shoot. And as you can see, the goalie slid over and is in a decent position to try to make a stop from that close range. So making that pass, that last additional pass over is not a bad idea. And that's exactly what happens right there just so we can all see what's going on. Puck is now over here. And what that's gonna allow for is a pretty nice setup shot on the goal, which is wide open right there. The goalie's momentum was moving so hard this way, he bit really hard on that original pass, just backing that up. You're gonna see right here uh, the goalie's sliding over. You can see right in that area, right in the crease, coming across the crease. And he's coming over with a lot of speed, so he has a difficult time recovering by the time that last shot goes in. You can see there's just a ton of open space here. And we're going to get another really good look at it as this play evolves here when they show it in a, the, uh, the slow-mo from a different angle. So let's get into that. Okay, freeze it right there. Here we are at the beginning. Breakout play happening. You've got your puck handler. You've got your other forward. You've got your 1D who's going to get caught in the middle, a little monkey in the middle. So that happens right here on sides. There goes the pass back over and shot on goal. Let's just see how, again, this happens pretty quickly. This is where the pass is being made. So it's over and back. There's the first pass. Okay, this is where we were saying, now if you take a close look, shooter has the option of, or I'm sorry, the current puck handler has the option of shooting, but the goalie recovered pretty well to come over and block that. So from this angle, skater could hook around this way, come around behind the net, or also additionally make that last pass this way, which is ultimately what happens. And just take a look as that goalie slides over. Now that this, now that the puck is right here, just take a look at how much open net there is in this at this moment 
it's just an incredibly wide open net, which makes it really easy for that skater to just tuck it home right there. Wide open net. And that's the magic of passing. See, that pass, this pass this way is what got everybody to shift their focus over from D away from the skater who originally was bringing it up the ice, which leaves a wide open net and a great goal scoring chance right there. We're gonna see it from one more angle. Let's get into that last angle, on sides, into the offensive zone. It's a sweet little backhand pass that makes it through that defensive skater just can't get his can't draw his stick in close enough it's right by his feet can't get his feet out quite fast enough to block it and then just highlighting again the goalie notices it and comes over to recover this defensive skater is drawn in this way everybody's looking this way and what you have is a wide open skater over here who's got nothing but open ice and so what you'll see in this last this last time here is again this pass being made defenseman again burned on a puck that's between the stick and his skates goalie can't recover notices what's going on and he's just beat he knows it but look he's there's no way that he can recover at this point and he knows it and who else knows it he knows it he knows it he knows it this guy's way behind the play he knows it and really quite honestly this is about as easy as a goal as you're going to get tucks that right home boom wide open net at this point the goalie is literally, I mean, there's absolutely nothing in front of the goal. It is about as wide an open net as you can get. And it all happened because of the magic of passing, passing in the offensive zone, a pass, a well-executed pass that got everybody on the defense to be drawn over to the other side of the ice and left the original man wide open and the presence of mind for that other pass to come in at the last second instead of shooting it or doing something else. It would have been a decent opportunity to shoot it right there, but that extra pass, well executed, made it an obvious goal versus a you know a moderate chance at, at getting a goal. So there you have it. That's another pro hockey breakdown looking at passing the magic of passing in the offensive zone on a breakout. Hope you enjoyed it. If you're enjoying these videos, please hit the subscribe button. There'll be more coming out um, in the near future. Thank you so much.